subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi everyone, welcome to Test Prep Training. In this video you will learn about some commonly asked questions in Palo Alto Network's Certified Cybersecurity Entry Level Technician. So let's get started. Question number 1, which analysis detonates previously unknown submissions in a custom-built, evasion-resistant virtual environment to determine real-world effects and behavior? Your options are A. Dynamic B. Pre-exploit protection C. Bare metal D. Static the correct answer is, option A. Question number 2, what is required for a SIEM to operate correctly to ensure a translated flow from the system of interest, to the SIEM data lake? Your options are A. Connectors and interfaces B. Infrastructure and containers C. Containers and developers D. Data center and UPS The correct answer is, option A. Question number 3, which type of Wi-Fi attack depends on the victim initiating the connection? Your options are A. Evil Twin B. Jazziger C. Parager D. Mirai The correct answer is, option B. Question number 4, which term describes data packets that move in and out of the virtualized environment from the host network, or a corresponding traditional data center? Your options are A. North-South traffic B. Intrazone traffic C. East-West traffic D. Interzone traffic The correct answer is, option A. Question number 5, which organizational function is responsible for security automation, and eventual vetting of the solution to help ensure consistency through machine-driven responses to security issues? Your options are a. NetOps B. SecOps C. SecDevOps D. DevOps The correct answer is, option B. Question number 6, on an endpoint, which method should you use to secure applications against exploits? Your options are A. Endpoint-based firewall B. Strong user passwords C. Full disk encryption D. Software patches the correct answer is, option A. Question number 7, which not-for-profit organization maintains the common vulnerability exposure catalog that is available through their public website? Your options are A. Department of Homeland Security B. MITRE C. Office of Cybersecurity and Information Assurance D. Cybersecurity Vulnerability Research Center The correct answer is, option B. Question number 8, which Palo Alto Networks tools enable a proactive, prevention-based approach to network automation that accelerates security analysis? Your options are A. Mind Melt B. Autofocus C. Wildfire D. Cortex XDR The correct answer is, option D. Question number 9, which endpoint product from Palo Alto Networks can help with SOC visibility? Your options are A. Sticks B. Cortex XDR C. Wildfire D. Auto Focus The correct answer is, option B. Question number 10, which technique changes protocols at random during a session? Your options are A. Use of non-standard ports B. Port hopping C. Hiding within SSL encryption D. Tunneling within commonly used services The correct answer is, option B. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel, 